opportunity for the creative community. Almost complete, one photo left. The yellow photo. Alright, hi guys, welcome to another uh, gear review video. Um, today we're talking about my light stand case. So this is everything has to do with artificial flash. Um, again, this is another SKB case. Uh, I, I love them. I highly recommend them being waterproof and crush proof. They've got, you know, these metal grommets here to put locks on, but if you don't want to do that, you can replace, you know, all of, or just two like I have with these, um, these TSA locks, right? So these latches are replaceable, um, just like the handles are and the rollers and everything else. Uh, so, you know, these locks can be opened by the TSA if they have to, since this is a checked item, um, I'm not present when they have to open it and I don't want it to be unlocked. So I will lock it with a TSA lock. So, you know, if they need to get into it, they can, they have before, um, you know, they didn't have to cut off a lock or anything. So this is nice to have, uh, they do have a lot of latches on this case, but it's a, you know, it's a fairly large case. So it works out pretty well. Um, so opening that comes into here. And this is pretty much everything that I take with me to an on-location shoot. Um, so first of all, here's um, Godox stuff. I love Godox. This is the 8600. Um, and the battery for that guy is right here. Take that out and put that there. Um, good, cheap snoot. It's really uh, always good to have. Um, this is my... I guess this is a beauty dish. Um, this is the, uh, it folds out like kind of like an umbrella and has a white inside. It's really good for, you know, up close looks on, on faces. Uh, you know, just a standard reflector. These guys, you can put a speed light in it and, you know, screw it down like a little vise. And this on the other side has, um, this is Bowen's mount. So I can put anything that's a Bowen's mount on here like a standard reflector fits in here just fine. And then you can have this on a, uh, you know, on a speed light. Um, then, and of course this mounts to, um, the light stands that are in there. So we have two of them. Uh, these are, I've got two of them in here. These are just the standard, uh, 24 by 36 ProMaster soft boxes that are, are I highly recommend. I just don't like using them a lot because they have a silvery inside, something like this. Um, but it takes them a long time to set up and put down. So, I mean, I will use them for product photography because it gives a nice, um, nice light for that type of stuff. So, um, there's that. And then I have two light stands that are in there that I always have with me. Uh, these are chargers for the, um, the 8600. My pocket flash or a speed light, I guess. More mag mod gear. I am a mag mod nut. So this is the um, this is the mag beam, right? So you put it on on your um, your speed light, and it magnifies um, that light to a far distance away. This is a uh, is really nice to have for shoots if you know you can't get up close and your your subjects are far away. Um, you know, you can have an assistant or whatever hold that light on to them and um, be able to illuminate them well. Uh, this is more MagMod stuff. This is their magnetic wallet that they have where I have my gels in here for, um, for speed lights. And then um, uh, directional, mo uh, not directional modifiers, but these are, um, these are ge geometry modifiers. Really nice to have. You get them fits in this system right here. And that's about it. I've got some spare components here. It's always important to have wristbands. And then I've got a couple of these guys. And, uh, you know, these are for, you know, of course, a hair tie, too. These are for the light stands. They go in the top of the light stands. Because these are just loose in there. So it's always good to have a replacement on hand for that. 
and man, that's 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 it. There there's nothing to my lighting setup. But because all this stuff is kind of expensive and kind of fragile, I need to keep all this stuff protected. So I use this case. So this is it. And then we're going to do a, um, a really quick video of putting everything back in the case sped up. So stand by for that. There we go, guys. You like this video? Please like and subscribe. More amazing, great videos. And in the comment section, if you want to uh, ask me a question about anything that I have in here, any gear reviews, anything that you have in your mind, let me know. And I might make a video on it one day. You never know.